Hello, long time no see tubers, and welcome back to Let's Play Might and Magic 7 with me, Blowing Kilo. Now, for you, this may just seem like normal if you're watching them day to day, but I haven't played the game in like <laughs> three weeks. I recorded way ahead back a few weeks ago because I was having a really good time, and then I was taking a break to upload the episodes, of course, and then I got really sick and I couldn't hardly talk for a couple weeks, so I'm really out of practice. I'm also having headset issues. I don't want to bore you guys to tears, but I did replace my headset a couple episodes back, and it's supposed to be the same basic version of my old headset that I liked, except that it's got really wonky like software drivers, so if there's an annoying whine in the background, I'm working on it, if you can hear that, and if my volume's... I don't know. Right now I have my... my microphone set at like 5%. It's really weird. That's totally not normal. Anyway, back to the game. Let's let's get to it. Um, we've got our four uh, amazing adventurers. Broar, who's our Archmage and rains fire from above. We have Sanless, the uh, mighty flail basher uh, and also healer. And we have Klonoa, the occasional guard murderer slash thief slash pretty good at pointing people Sticking people with the pointy end. That's that's what I wanted to say. And we have the commander, who last episode we spent hours um, winning in the arena. I think we need to go get him promoted. Uh, I think that's what I was about to do, right? Uh, yeah, because Klonoa still has more HP, so he's going to go get promoted. And then we've got to figure out a way to get levels up without having a lot of money. And someone suggested uh, that perhaps the Stone City uh, trainer is one of the cheaper ones that can level you up a long way. So that's kind of the plan. I've, I've had a fair number of good comments that uh, I haven't been able to uh, obviously react to because I've recorded so far in advance. Um, one of the things that makes sense is I, I set my Lloyd's Beacon to Bracada Desert here. That's actually a mistake, uh, and I should have known better um, now that I think about it. These three are good, uh, but the Bracada Desert, I mean, how do we get there? Well, uh, we can get there without any... It's a little bit of messing around, but if we go to Celeste... Um, for one, there should be a way back down, um, wherever the teleporter up was, I can't even remember where it is now, it's been so long. But someone suggested that uh, you can also do this, if you happen to have air magic. We cast Featherfall, and uh, you know, just jump for a jump. Should be totally cool, yeah. So this takes us to, um, Bracotta just fine, which is actually where I wanted to go, that's why I wanted to demonstrate that. So I do appreciate the useful suggestions in the comment section. Uh, I just, you know, I've recorded so far in advance and I've probably forgotten some by now. So uh, I keep them coming. I'll try to show them off when I can remember. If not, uh, you know, the <laughs> it's appreciated basically. That's all I mean to say. So anyway, we're here in Bracada and I'm heading to the south because I'm pretty sure that's where, oh, don't I have like double speed? There we go. Um, I'm pretty sure it's somewhere over here that we're, we're looking for, um, the promotion item. Hey, what's all this stuff? I don't even know why that's all on the ground there. Maybe I just forgot about it. <laughs> There's a lot of random stuff that Perception can find you, so I guess that's what we're doing. Is this the house? I think, maybe? Yeah, champion. There we go. Alright, Commander. I've totally... D didn't I do that last episode? Or did I... Did I load the wrong game? <laughs> This is going to make me look really bad. I loaded the quick save. Um, didn't we already figure this out? I, yeah, I thought, now that I think about it, didn't I turn this quest in at the end of the last one? Italia, November, December 7th doesn't seem correct. Oh no, guys, this is very unprofessional. <laughs> oh, drat. Oops, that was not what I meant to do. I just loaded the very first save. So that was the Celeste save. This is where... November 7th. That's what we started today's episode at. Yeah, that should have been the latest... Uh, auto save. Or quick save. Did I... F maybe I forgot to save it. No. That's... That's horrible. This is the other one. Um, oh. Yeah, there we go. Okay, so... Why are we here? We just... Oh, this is where I trained... Okay, we got it. Okay, sorry folks. Sorry for that awkward introduction. I just, I forgot to go quick save. <laughs> what a good start to the episode. Four minutes in and you're all wondering what the heck I'm talking about. Okay, cool, cool. We're, we're sorted. We've got no money. I stand by my resetting um, 
of uh, the Lloyd's Beacon. Oh, I know! I spent a little bit of time off camera. Didn't I? I thought I was I was gonna spend some time off camera, like buying and selling. Whatever. We'll get to that later. Let's get let's go do some quests. Honestly, it's quest time. <laughs> let's see what we've got. Um, sabotage the lift. That means kill slimes and maybe medusas, possibly. Actually, you know, I think I want to do the Telerian forest stuff. Um, calm the trees. I think there's probably a couple more too. Griffin Hart's trumpet, somewhere in Telerian forest. That one we're saving for later. Uh, we're saving that for later for sure. The Negon's tunnels, those are dangerous. Um, statuettes. I could try that. I just have to travel around. It's actually probably much easier now that we have Lloyd's Beacon. I just have to find them. And then we'll have to find the statuettes and then have to put... I guess... Okay, that's the problem. Sorry. I need to find statuettes. I don't know where they are. And then put them on shrines that are fairly easy to find. Paintings, I don't know. Acromage, I'll get to it eventually. I'm just not in a big rush. So I think I'm going to do Telerian first. Maybe I'll do the Stonehenge monoliths after that. Uh, Tatalia, Evanmorn, Avli, that seems pretty easy. I may have even done it already by accident. And then we'll maybe try to do the lift. I don't know. There's probably lots of quests I haven't even picked up yet, so... Anyway, we need more levels up, we need more money, we gotta figure stuff out. So, Lloyd's Beacon. Recall. Oh, this is really bad. I've lost all my beacons. Ah, well, things are not off to a great start. Um, <laughs> shoot. Trasia. Do I even have... Okay, yeah, we can always town portal to Negon at least. Well, that's good. Alright, so we need to go to the Telerian forest. I've totally messed this all up. I, I, I really do apologize. <laughs> Alright, let's go, let's go do something. Let's go, I think I've killed everything on this map. We killed a dragon. We killed a bunch of trolls. It wasn't that bad. Um, we could go back to even Moon Island somewhere over there. What's in here? Have we got this already? Of course we have. What am I thinking? We'll go south. We'll take a trip to Telerian Forest. I'll show you guys how it's like to travel around. I cut that out a lot, but, uh, you know, it's fun. There are a lot of random things on the ground these days. It's true. All right, so Avli, where do we go? That's not where I want to go. Wait till dawn. Wait an hour. Get attacked? What? You never get attacked here. Elite archers? Why are these guys trying to kill me? Okay, hold on. Put it to normal speed. So there's just... Everyone's asleep still, so it's a little bit difficult here. Until they get shot or something. Really? Well, I guess we can kill some archers. How would you like to die? Okay, Sandless, it's all up to you. One shot, good. Come on, just finish him off. Finish him off. He's just sitting there. He's not even moving. He's drowning. He's, he's told. There you go. You flailed him to death. Excellent. Um, we don't even get any treasure for that because it's in the water. All right, now this guy. Are you gonna behave, elite archer? So I don't know what we're doing. We're just we're just gonna kill him. No, don't hide in the boat. I can't even hit you in there. Well, this is awkward. Come on. Well, this is this is really not helping. Now there's an archer inside the boat. You know what? Probably if I just go to the inn, I can just rest a day and he'll disappear, probably. The inn's around here somewhere, isn't it? Yeah. Come in, come in. Let's try that. We'll also buy some food. Right away. Enjoy your stay. And no, we still have okay, he moved at least. That's important. And everyone's awake. So hold on, hold on. Slow it down. Let's think about this here. We're just gonna wait a couple turns. We're gonna have some flight. And then we're just gonna go kill him. We should be fine now. Yeah. We'll do melee. Okay, we're drowning even though we can fly, so we'll just hop up just a little bit. I don't know. Yeah, we're good. Alright, so this guy's toast, right? Totally toast. Please tell me he's toast. Yeah, there you go. Good job. Okay. Wow, this is an interesting story. Welcome aboard! Erathia. Uh, can we get to... Can Sorry, get... you don't have enough gold. <laughs> <laughs> it's 
seriously? All right, all right. I thought I would go that way. We'll go the um. I guess it's it is pointless to take a ship there. Oh, I can just town portal it. I f yeah, I've told you. <laughs> all right, one point for everyone who's laughing at me. Telerian, we can just town portal to. It was. Avli, and actually where we are right now that needs town portals. Avli and Tatalia. Um, so, let's do that before we leave. <laughs> Lloyd's Beacon. Set beacon here. Alright, that'll do. And then we'll just town portal out. <laughs> I guess you guys can probably tell. I haven't played much lately. <laughs> Alright. Hello, peasant. Rocky the Porter. Ah, uh, glad you didn't see anything like we just did. Okay, so. Trees. We're gonna go visit some trees and beat them up because uh, we saw these much, much earlier on in the game, and I never really fought them. So let's go see what's over here. And hopefully they give us some good money or something. Let's just check that quest one more time so I know what I'm supposed to be doing here. Calm the trees by killing them in Solarian Forest after speaking to the oldest tree. All right, and then we go back to Bricotta. And there's also some trumpet that's in the Battle of Tolarian Forest. All right. We have a couple things to try out over here. Um, we could probably do them quicker by flying. <laughs> flying is cool like that. Alright, let's, uh, okay, trees. They are, for how strong we are, they should be very, very easy. So let's just go punch Bring them. Bring on a bigger challenge. Okay. We probably could have fought the trees a little bit earlier. I'm just thinking here. We could kill them in range probably pretty easy too. Let's see, what do we get from trees? Nothing. We don't get any money at all. That sucks. All right, you killed that tree. Good job, Commander. He was really weak. And Broar. Just a scratch. There you go. Some money. Killing trees left and right. Ah, <laughs> uh, but you never thought we'd be tree killers. Yeah. Okay. Normal trees are not very tough. I mean, I I speak both. In game and out of game. Trees, you know, they're usually not terribly dangerous to the average uh, healthy adults. Maybe if you climbed them and fell off of them. Uh, ah, maybe if scratch. they uh, rotted and Bring fell on, on top of shower. you. I mean, they could land on your house. Uh, that would cause it's some damage. Maybe uh, maybe if you were sleeping oh, a uh, and a tree fell through your window, that just could kill you. I mean, I don't know. <laughs> Honestly, they're just trees. What can they do? These guys have teeth, and they spit at you, I guess. <laughs> Alright, a little bit of healing time. I really do need that power or power cure. I know we've been talking about it in the comments for a while. One of these days, as soon as I've got money. As soon as I get money, we'll get some levels up. We'll uh, buy some new spells. Have a good time. I don't know. Oh, right. I can't identify it. Who does the identifying? Sorry, can't I don't know. <laughs> ah, Broar does the identifying. Of course he does. I knew that. Totally. <laughs> so where's the Elder Tree, anyway? I mean, are you going to come out, Elder Tree? We're killing all your children, basically. Trees. Trees don't have feelings. They're just trees. Alright. We dealt with the tree problem, one way or the other. Um, north, I have to imagine this is just the edge of the map, probably. So where, do, where would this take us if we were to follow the path here? Do, 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 this would take us to Av- Oh, you actually can walk to Avli. I thought it was an island. Oh, well. So you can get there by walking. That's great. We got some gold over here. A little bit of gold. I really do need like all the money I can get. I'll probably do some more crafting with the ore before too long. Mercury. I don't really want to do potion brewing too bad. Oh, what's this? Elven defenders and soldiers. Oh, they're not really fighting us. Are they? Are you going to fight me? No, you're fighting each other. Okay. So it's the elves and the humans fighting, I think. I think. Good job. Oh, there's the Grimfin Harp Trumpet. We got it. That was super easy. Okay, we could have done that a lot earlier, too, then. You just walk over here. They don't even touch you. Oh, you know what would be perfect is a meteor right here. Sorry, I can't help. That's a, that's a lot of soldiers. Oh, yes. <laughs> 
<laughs> so, guys, do you guys hate me now? Or are you running away? That one's running away. Oh, yes. Anybody else? You guys gonna come fight now? Yeah, they're coming to kill us. Alright. Oh, but that was that was worth it, right? <laughs> I know we're supposed to be on the path of good, but it's just a oh. scratch. Yeah, it's just a, just a scratch. Got him. I really need more um spells like fire magic too. I I, I realize. Okay, you guys all gather up right underneath me. And then we're just gonna go over here quick. Yeah, perfect. We'll just shoot a couple arrows at the Elven Defender. Can we not? Yes! Yeah, there you go, good. And that guy running away. And then here's the big one. Meteor. God, oh yes! I love it. <laughs> okay. Now I don't know exactly how much experience we're gonna get, or gold or anything. But uh, it's, it's got to be worth something, right? And it's so easy. Got him. Oops. Okay, let's just turn that off. We'll be fine. <laughs> now, to be honest, they're not the weakest enemies. But <laughs> okay, well that was fun. So we get about a hundred gold per kill. I imagine our reputation in this area is ruined. Um, but oh, look at all that gold! Yes. We ended the war by killing everyone. I'm glad to be back. <laughs> this is what everyone was waiting for. Alright, good. We got lots of money. Actually, it wasn't too bad. Uh, I suppose we're supposed to check whatever this is out, hey? Let's just see. I picked up I a couple things. Know. <laughs> it's basically just garbage. Let's just throw it away. It's not worth our time to carry, basically. I can't identify yeah, it. Just but we got the trumpet, so this one, we can either give it to the elves or the humans. I uh, I don't really care. We'll give it to somebody. It's, I don't know. Quest item artifact. No army that has fought on the side of this trumpet has ever been defeated. We should just keep it for ourselves, honestly. <laughs> anyway, Telerian Caves. I, I have no idea. Let's just check it out. We got this has all the makings wyverns. For adventure. Okay, adventure. So, ah, so okay. Hold on, hold on, hold on. How tough are wyverns or wyverns, as you may like to say? Um, they're not that bad. We'll just we'll just do some random adventuring here. I'm not certain. Nice hit, Broar. Good job. Six damage. Sorry, okay. I can't you guys are good. These guys aren't that tough. Oh, also, I always forget this spell. I do realize it's useful, and then I forget about it. I don't even remember where it is. Wizard's Eye. It is very useful. Also, before I forget... Do, 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 torchlight! Easier for the YouTubes to see what I'm doing. Alright. So let's see. What have we got? Elven Warriors. You guys want to fight? Apparently, yes. <laughs> Stupid elves. Bring on a bigger challenge. We're just going to kill all the elves from now on. And all the humans. We're just going to kill everyone. Honestly. I don't know. Am I messing up quests by doing this? Possibly. Do I really feel bad? I need the money. I really, really need experience and money right now. And these guys, you know, they seem like easy pickings, honestly. They don't have any ranged attack. They're barely wearing clothes. Maybe Broar feels bad. Isn't he an elf? Maybe. Got it. Alright. Nothing terribly exciting, I don't think. Hm. I suppose because we're still in the Telerian Forest. Um, hm. Oh, letter from Mr. Stantley. Okay, we'll have a look at that. Hm. Um, because we're still in the Telerian Forest, we're probably at like a pretty low-level loot sort of thing. What does this say? Um... Oh, I wonder if this is like... Remember those quests where we just lied back and forth? Maybe this is one of the dungeons for that, where you were supposed to come here and pick up these things. Maybe. Yeah, this is probably how you were supposed to... Uh, how to how to uh, sneak the guy out of prison, right? That was the quest? So there's a bit of a trap here, if you're not paying attention. Like, this elf over there is probably going to get pushed over. Can't even see him. Oh, he made it. 
Screen on a bigger well, he tower. was immune to traps, but not immune to being stabbed by Commander. Let's do some regeneration. That's another spell I haven't really tried out much yet. Let's see. Regeneration. On anyone who's got some damage. We'll see how it works. Because we're not in any real pressing danger. <laughs> so we can spend our time just uh, healing up over time. It seems to be working pretty good, honestly. That was too easy. Keep an eye on the life bars. That might be the way to go. Elven Lancer. Okay, are those the tough ones? Yeah, they're a little bit tougher. Nah, it's just a scratch. Actually, they hit us. They hit us pretty good. Good job, Elven Lancer. Too bad you're dead. <laughs> and where's your little friend? Get back here. Yeah, that's what I thought. Okay, so this is where you get knocked off if you fall for the trap, which might happen. Possibly. Let's give it a try. So yeah, this will be the... I'm pretty sure this will be the dungeon. Run, run, run. Uh oh oh. Oh, we got... Well, I don't know how that worked. We got, like, teleported around. That didn't seem fair. Probably shouldn't try it on double speed now that I think about it. But yeah, I just figured I'd show off this this little uh, dungeon while I'm here. Yeah, it's just a scratch. Run away. That's the right. That's the right. Weakling. All right. So, how are we going to make it through here? It's probably just a matter of timing. Oh, that'll do. Okay. <laughs> yeah, it's super easy. It's just a matter of timing. <laughs> so, jump up here. Who wants to drink? Sandless, you're up. Apparently, it's nothing. Could be like a teleporter or something, maybe. Hmm, is this going to take me to the dungeon? I, I wonder know. what's in there. Mm. Mosquito oh, dragonflies. Those things aren't dangerous. Oh, right. Yellow barrel. Okay, so dragonflies, seriously? Elven Ranger. Oh, you're pretty tough. We'll fight that one. Oh, yes. When I say pretty tough, I mean <laughs> tough-ish. Got it. Well, <laughs> I think because we already did this quest, there's very little to do here. I gotta keep checking those paintings till I get all three of them, too. Got it. I love not being killed by cupboards anymore, also. That's very nice. I wonder if that was, like, the prisoner that we could have released. No, I don't know. Okay, let's just save it here, just in case I get in a huge fight with all the castle. <laughs> That's just a scratch. Which is likely that I'm actually doing that right now. Ah, what a so, scratch. yeah, okay, I'm going to assume then that what you had to do was sneak through the caves or something, rescue somebody in here, and then leave this way. And that I actually did it all backwards, which is fine. Right? It's totally cool. Yeah, because you jump down, sort of a one-way passage, kind of. And, well... Hmm, I don't know. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Because falling down, it does seem like uh, I went through it the correct route. Maybe you have to sneak through this way first, and then you you escape with them or something. That, that seems fair. Let's just finish up this dungeon. Looks like there's a couple more little areas we didn't go to. Ugh. Should be fine, right? That regeneration spell seems to be doing really good. Makes me spend much less time bothering with healing. Okay, so there's something over there. I don't know how we're going to get over there. This is that main room. Probably a useful time for us to have a uh, feather fall, right? Oh, hello. Okay, okay. Meant to pause it faster there. Okay, yeah, that took some damage. It took a bit of a hit. What do we have? Sorry, I... Um, implosion. I think I was using this uh, acid burst the most. That was really good. Oh, so. yes. That's just a scratch. That's just a scratch. I'm not certain. I'm not... Yeah, that Lancer's got a lot of HP. So we'll just acid burst him a couple times. Uh. Should be okay. Uh. I'm definitely glad that I paused it here, because... These guys are pretty tough. Not that one, though. Alright, we got it. 
That wasn't very hard. Not too difficult. Hmm. What's this? Oh, jumpity jumpity puzzle. Okay, so I came in over there and I walked up that way, right? We've never been down, and there's treasure up there that I don't know exactly how to get to. Hmm. We'll just... Oh, troglodytes. Tro they're nothing. And a wyvern. Well... Oh, are you fighting the troglodytes down there? That's cool. Good for you. Hmm. Hey, what, what was that? Something hit me. I don't know what it was. Can I just, like... I don't know what I was thinking, to be honest. I'm thinking there's a lot of, uh... Wyverns and stuff down here. Perhaps enough to warrant... A fireball? What do you guys think? I'm not certain. Helped out. Has to help out. Oh, wow, they're not really that tough. Good job, team! Alright. We see some treasure, making it worthwhile to come down here. Got it. Hopefully. I can't help with that. Hmm. Considering how badly I need money. Ooh, that was a good one. 1500. Very nice catch. Hmm. Hmm. It's disarmed. Lots of money. I guess what I should do is go back to the Barrow Downs by now and see if that super hmm. chest has respawned yet. The one that had all the really, really good stuff in it. And like 10,000. Oh, wait. Stone to Flesh is a very nice scroll to hold on to. Just in case something bad happens. Some scrolls are worth keeping on. They're kind of in the Too Good to Use Club, but if I ever have the party turn to stone, you'll be glad I had a couple. Okay, Weverns. Wivy, wivy, wivies. You guys aren't that tough. Three of you. We'll go on turn mode, and then we'll just crush them. Yeah. That's what I thought. Okay, well, is that basically cover the... I know there's a couple areas up above that we haven't got to yet. Um, but we can't really fly, so... Maybe up this way? Hmm. Seems like we're kind of stuck in the, the area you fall down into, rather than the way to get to the good stuff. Which is fine. It's no big deal. And then I just, now I'm stuck going around in circles. Ha-ha! That's the spirit blue. Go around in circles. Um... So is it this way out? This seems like further down. There's got to be a way out. What am I missing here? Click on walls? Oh, this one. Okay, yeah, this is it. This is the way up. Okay, that's the exit. Good. So the only thing we never really managed to do was get a couple treasure chests up on the roof, I think. I'm not going to worry about it, honestly. I think we've done good enough. Um, so we'll just we'll spend a little bit more time clearing this out. I never found that tree. So I'll spend a couple more minutes looking around the, the, uh, the map room. The map area. What am I looking for? I'm looking for fly. Where's fly? The boots fly. Alright. So now we've completely finished the battle. Totally good, right? <laughs> Alright, so... Maybe over in that area? Is that possible? What do you guys think? Like I said, I don't want to spend all day, but... Did I say that? I meant to say that. After such a... Oh, that looks like a good... There's like a forest of trees over there. Or a island of trees. Of course it's a forest of trees. All forests are full of trees. Whoa, what is this? Hey, it's one of these little tester things. What do you guys think? Broar is not even smart enough for this thing. We really need to get a spell that boosts our uh, intellect. There's a few ways to do it, I know. I've had a couple comments on that as well. What the heck is this thing? Where are we? It's like a mighty, mighty bridge. Well, we'll start on the north side, I guess. We'll see what we can do. But one of these days, we'll have a spell that buff... buff buffs all of our stats, and we'll go do all of those tests. Shrines of Test. Clanker's Laboratory. That does not sound like the kind of place we would run into a, uh, a old tree. It sounds kind of like another dungeon for another day, perhaps. Clanker. I don't think we've heard anything about any clankers, honestly. 
We could kill all these trees. I'm sure they're, they're really not that tough. Oh, some treasure. Ah, Klonoa, you know what to do. <laughs> Steal it all. Actually, it really wasn't worth our time. So let's go to the other island. There was one yellow. Oh, that's where I killed a tree. I'm looking at the uh, the mini-map, trying to keep track, because maybe if I can talk to someone, he'll be a different color than all the red trees. Where is the elder tree? Oh, there's some more treasure chests. Huh. Hmm. This really isn't all that profitable, to be honest. Oh, oh! Tree 69! <laughs> Hello, oldest tree! He speaks very slowly. Well, we're not going to waste a whole lot of time. Okay, so the, the the thieves stole his heart. They're hiding in the mercenary guild. Oh, good! We know where that is! That We know where that is! Totally! We'll do that! No problem. Awesome! You don't mind if we kill some of your friends, do you? I can't awesome. help with that. Uh, I don't really need any of this other stuff. Just a scratch. Is there any more treasure chests while I'm looking around? Here? I think we're. I think we got most of them. Okay. Well, I think. I think this will wrap the episode up then. Woohoo! Uh, so what I will do uh, to save a little bit of time is I'll meet you next episode in Tatalia, and I will probably sell I can't most of this junk, um, including the rubies, because those look. That's pretty good. Uh, did I ever get... No, I still don't have Merchant Grandmaster. Hmm. I really should go to... Okay, let's do that right now. I've got enough money. And then we're going to make more money in the future. Long term, guys. you got to think long term. So let's do that this episode. Oops, almost killed somebody. Got to be careful. So the trick was... Town Portal to Celeste. Uh, we've got Flight. Let's just recast Featherfall just in case. Just in case, you never know. And we can still fly, so obviously that stuff didn't wear out. Uh, Air Grandmaster. I'm pretty sure it's like right here. Yes, there we go. 8,000 gold. I'm pretty sure this will pay us back in no time. So, um, there we go. Alright, so I will meet you guys back in Tatalia. Um, probably next episode. Hopefully next episode, unless something really bad happens. Um, what I need to do is find is uh, lead of another portal there, uh, Lloyd Beacon. Sorry, uh, we'll get there from. I think you can take a boat from Arathia pretty easily, so that'll be the plan anyway. All right, folks. So thanks for watching. I hope you've enjoyed, and I'll see you guys next time for some more fun. Hopefully with less problems. <laughs>